I started the Provo River Race for really two reasons. Number one, because it's super fun to be able to get everybody together, just have this community of people that's coming down to enjoy the river, even, have a fun day. Even watching you, even watching you roll the start, I was like, holy shit, how are you keeping up with it? It's super fun to have a little bit of competition with it too. So I love setting up the gates, being able to actually just make some of those turns, some of those moves, things that you wouldn't naturally or normally do or think of. It's just something fun to be able to just kind of push yourself and challenge. Get it? that I did the Provo River Race though is because I think a lot of people miss how beautiful this canyon really is. This area is so amazing. We have such a good resource that I don't think we use as much as we possibly should. And it's a big drive for me to do this race every single year that I want to try to use it to create a recreational release on the Provo River. I'd love to be able to set something up that we could set a day every single year where we knew we were going to have water flowing regardless of what kind of snow year it was, so that we could actually enjoy this river on a regular basis. The race this year went really well. Uh, we were able to set the gates. We were at a medium flow, just about two inches below the pipe. Um, I want to say that we were somewhere around 550 cubic feet per second. Super fun to watch. Uh, the gates, I actually felt were pretty te technical. By the time I got to the end, personally, I was exhausted. <laughs> Which is, you know, I got to the end, I was like, who the freaking head set these gates? All right, Liam Redman did amazing. He crushed it the whole way through. I think he had a completely clean run on his second run, which was really cool because uh, he was ended up being the winner. Um, and then the motocross. Motocross is so much fun. Uh, we started out with two groups of five, and that was tight because this isn't a very big river. And uh, the final though, we were we ended up having to do uh, one group of six and six paddlers on the river at the same time became a bit spicy. Uh, I know me and Le Liam, we were fighting for it at the very beginning, trying to see who could get, get the whole shot first. Uh, but it was super fun. Everyone stayed safe. We didn't have any swimmers. We didn't have any issues. Thank you to everyone who came out to the Bubba River Race this year. Uh, I'm grateful for the opportunity to be able to put this on. I hope that I get to do it every single year. Uh, pray for snow because if we get snow then I can guarantee that we get to do it. If not, um, it's a it's a struggle. Uh, but I'm happy to do all of this. I'm happy to just see the community and people come together and uh, hope that I get many, many years to come to be able to put this on.